What's up guys, my name is Rob, this channel is Decoded and in the next three or four minutes I'm going to show you how to quickly add two completely different textures to either side of a face in Blender. Uh, this is a really good one if you're making things like plants where from a long distance you wouldn't be able to tell the front from the back of a leaf, right? But if you're doing a close-up shot with a plant the front of a leaf or a petal doesn't look the same as the back. You need to have two different textures if you want photorealism. So this won't take long, I'll just jump straight in and show you how this works. So I'm just going to add a plane and I have it set to a line to front view here. And I'm going to jump straight over the shading menu, create a new material. And if I go over to my texture folder here, I have uh, these two images here. It's the back and the front of a leaf, right? One of them's green, one's orange. And we want to be able to display both sides of that. So what we're going to do is drag this green one over, connect the colour up, I'm going to connect the subsurf, I'm going to connect it up to the normal and run it through a bump node, like so, and I'm going to get the alpha channel and I'm going to connect that up to alpha. We can probably turn the bump down as well to something like 0.5 and put the subsurf on like 0.3. Right, so if we have a look at this in cycles, we have a leaf. But if we turn the leaf around, it looks exactly the same on both sides. It's green. It looks like the, the back of the leaf on both sides. So we want that orange side as well, right? So what we're going to do, I'll just go back into the preview tab here. And I'm just going to select all the nodes, duplicate them, and drag that down. Then if I come up to the, uh, the textures and drag in the other side and just connect them up, right? So diffuse and the normal and finally the alpha get rid of that node and now if we have a look at this one we have the opposite side here right but once again it's applied that texture to both sides so how do we make it apply differently well all we need to do is we need to add in a mix shader over here okay and we need to run both textures into this mix shader so plug that one at the bottom and this one at the top and if we preview this what we'll do is basically just overlay them both to get it to display on either side differently what we're going to add in is a geometry node okay so I'm going to do a search here for geometry and there it is and it has loads of different outputs on the geometry node right so it can give you different colors depending on the position of the normals the normal direction and all sorts of stuff. It has this one here called back facing, right? And what that does is it just gives all the back faces of your geometry a different color to the uh, the normal geometry, right? So we get the back face, we plug that into the factor, and if we run that back into the material output, you can see we've got the green leaf on this side, but if we turn the camera around, we have orange on the other. I'm just gonna duplicate this, rotate it, so we can see both sides at once and then if we go into cycles with this there's our two different color leaves so that was a really easy one I know guys but it's something that I didn't know how to do until recently if you found this video helpful please hit the like button it helps the channel to grow and please consider subscribing if you're not subscribed already I have lots of new content coming out very very soon until the next video guys I'll see you around